Aloha fellow Aries, it's Kim Jolene with Finding Your Fiji and I'm here doing your monthly reading for January 2019. I've been called to change things up a little bit this month which is always super fun for me and what I'm going to be doing because we are in a fresh year, the year of 2019, I am going to be giving you a little glimpse of the year ahead. So for Aries, we'll be getting the theme for the year for all of us, I'm an Aries as well, and then also information about our health and our careers and our romantic relationships in the month, not the month, in the year of 2019. So it's going to give you a little glimpse. I know that there's probably more information that you desire around the year of 2019. For instance, information about your finances or your life purpose, but those I'm reserving for doing individual appointments, so private angel readings, or for your 12-month forecast. So I do have a special that I'm sort of continuing this month. It's not quite as good as the one before the holidays, uh, but still a good deal on the 12-month forecast, and all of the details are below. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm always excited. This is always my favorite reading. You guys know that, right? Um, because I'm curious and excited to see. And then if you have not watched the Universal Forecast yet, I would encourage you to go and watch that. So there's going to be a link to that forecast below. And that is giving basically the theme and the energy for every month for the entire year. So, and that is for everyone. It's a universal forecast. So it's for everyone. And it was really fascinating to see what type of energy and the types of things that we are going to be called to do in different months of the year. So that's a really um, great forecast to watch as well. Um, and they kind of go hand in hand. So this one along with that one will give you a little bit of information about the year. 2019. So our theme for this year, drum roll, is the sun, Archangel Uriel. Ooh, ooh, I love this one. So Archangel Uriel is our idea angel, and this is about a happy outcome. Yay, we're going to have happy outcomes in 2019. And it is about brilliant ideas that lead to our success. So the important factor around this is to grab the ideas that you're receiving and take action on them. So I've been pushed to do some really big things this year, which I'm like, oh my gosh. Um, it's so funny because you think because I took the leap and moved from Minnesota to Maui without ever having visited here, literally sold all my, ho my house, all my stuff, moved away from everybody I know, new to an island where I knew no one, that was easier than some of the stuff they've been asking me to do this year. So I'm just like, oh my gosh, like it's so fascinating to me. Like I had a much easier time with that um, than some of the other things that they're asking me to do. But I... I really, when you follow the guidance and everything is lining up, you just, you got to follow the flow of it, right? It's like, you can't get out of the river midstream, just follow the flow. So that is uh, a beautiful piece about it. Um, having the confidence. So having confidence in yourself is going to be really important in the year of 2019. That's going to be a theme that comes in again and again. Have confidence, right? Okay, so let's see what is coming in for our health for the year of 2019. All right, sunlight, yay! <laughs> this always makes me happy because I love sunlight. Um, so Archangel Raphael is bringing the sunlight card in and letting us know that it's going to be important for us this year to be in the sun. To get, soak up that vitamin D, to be outside in nature is going to be something that's going to be really helpful for us throughout the entire year. Okay, so this is not something just for this month. This is for the entire year. It helps us um, energetically, and I think that's part of why I had to move to Maui also is because I just feel better when I can be outside in the sunlight and um, in, yeah, it just makes me feel better and I think it does most people, right? Um, so that's coming in and if you're wanting more ways to get in the sunlight, um, for instance, next November, you might want to come on my Maui retreat that I'm planning. Um, that's the thing that is like, um, talk about a leap of faith. Yeah, it's a big leap of faith because it's, um, 
it's very time consuming and expensive to put on. Um, and it's the sort of faith that, that uh, people are coming. And the angels have showed me, like there's, they definitely are lining people up to come to this retreat. But if you're interested in that, if you haven't been to Maui or haven't been here for a while or just love Maui, this retreat is for you because it is going to be amazing. And the place that we're staying is, oh my gosh, off the charts, like luxurious, like the best. It's going to be so amazing. So, oh, this is funny. They gave me two cards for a like purpose. Oh, so us, us Aries, you know, we always got to lead the way. We can't just have one thing that we're focusing on for our career this year, but we have to have two, right? Um, so perfect. Um, I just have to laugh at them. So the two things that are coming in for our career are creative expression. So our souls long for creative expression, and this has to be part of your career this year. You've got to have a, a career that you have some ability to be creative. It's something that we long for, something that is really important for us. Um, also part of our career, our life purpose, is bringing light and love to the world. So we have a dual purpose this year with creativity and light and love. Um, and the light and love is really just wherever you go, just beaming light bringing light, bringing love to wherever you go. And doing this consciously is always really helpful when you, you know, are getting ready to go to an event or you're just even getting in your car. Imagine you're just like, okay, I'm beaming love. I'm beaming light. I'm just bringing that. Wherever I'm going today, I'm going to bring that love. And it just, you just thinking about it makes me smile, right? So you can just go to the grocery store, bring the love and light to the grocery store. Bring them love and light to work, you know, whatever, wherever you're going throughout your day, bring that light and love throughout the year of 2019. Love, that's so good. All right, let's see what's happening for our relationships, people. All right, heart to heart conversation. So this is going to be important for you this year that you're really doing a good job communicating, that you're really um, sharing with your partner from your heart. So it's not going to be a surface type of relationship year. This is a deep relationship, heart-to-heart -heart conversations, um, honestly discussing your feelings, your emotions with your partner. That is going to be important. In the 5D, it just doesn't work to be have surface relationships. It's just not going to work. And particularly for us as light workers, it's not going to work for us. So we need to be able to have these heart to heart, these deep conversations with our partners. So that is what we've got for the year for you. I'm super excited. If you um, haven't watched the Universal Reading, as I mentioned, there's a link to that below. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and hit the bell so that you get notified when I post new videos. Otherwise, you will have no clue. So make sure that you do hit the bell, bell so you get notifications. And I've got another little video that's going to um, play next that's going to share with you what Flying Star Feng Shui is and why you might need that for your home and uh, also the information about the 12-month forecast. So much love and light. Have an amazing, amazing month. Aloha! Happy New Year! It's Kim Jolene with Finding Your Fiji and I know that we've just had our traditional New Year's yet the Chinese New Year is going to be beginning soon as well. That happens on February 4th. In preparation for that, I am offering a special on my Flying Star consultations. And Flying Star, if you're not familiar with that, uh, actually brings in the elements of time direction and space to create essentially a horoscope for your home and it's a beautiful way to see the energies of your home to amplify the positive energies and downplay the negative energies in your space and it also um, includes the energies for this particular coming year so as we move into the new year the flying stars do what they do they fly 
and they move and so things shift and change so what was last year will be different this year and there are specific adjustments that I provide in the Flying Star consultation not only for your house as a whole but also for the year of 2019 so specific things for you to place in specific locations and it's all very easily laid out for you and mapped out for you as we do that so you can save fifty dollars on my flying star consultation which is normally three hundred and fifty you get it for three hundred dollars with the coupon code flying 2019 and all of the links of course are below awesome I've also been guided to extend my 12 month forecast sale. So last month I was doing the, the 12 month forecast sale for 22% off and I've been guided to extend that coupon sale through the end of January. The coupon code is gonna be different though. It's gonna be 2019 will be the new coupon code for that. So you can save 22% on your 12 month forecast for the coming year and if you order mid-january i will do it from february and forward so that's kind of how that works if you want to purchase it as a gift for someone for their birthday for example that's in april you can let me know that you want me to do it um, from april forward right so i'll do 12 months whatever 12 months that you choose and you can choose to have a personal focus or a business focus so there's all the links and information below. I'm so excited to help you get set up for success in 2019. So much love and aloha.